Hey! Hey! I'm Mr. O, here with another. Oh, wow! A moment at the Children's Museum of Houston. So what do we do here? No, well, what you do is you take two dimensional shapes, put them together in a pattern, and then that two dimensional shape can become a three dimensional shape. That's really cool. So how does it work? Magnets. But that's a different episode. No, I mean, how can a series of two dimensional objects form a different three dimensional object? Oh, well, to understand that, we got to talk about nets. In math, a net is a two dimensional representation of a three dimensional object. Uh -huh. Think of it like this. All the world is made of shapes, two-dimensional objects like these squares and triangles. These shapes are put together to create depth, three-dimensional objects like a cube. If we were to peel away the outside of the three-dimensional objects, so all we had were two-dimensional shapes, we have a net. Let me show it to you a different way. Before we begin, remember, science is fun, but it can also be dangerous, so always have a responsible adult helping you. We're going to use a building set to explore nets. Fortunately, here at the Fiddlesticks gift shop in the Children's Museum of Houston, we have the perfect thing, mag formers. Try building three-dimensional shapes, breaking them down flat, and seeing what sort of nets you can form. How many nets can you create from one three-dimensional shape? What happens to your three-dimensional shape if you change your net? Nets are at the core of geometry. Many professions need to understand how three-dimensional objects are formed in order to design and build, like architects and engineers. And don't worry if you can't afford construction toys like the mag formers, there are many different products available. You can even cut shapes out of cardboard or paper. The key is to explore how the shapes interrelate and go from two dimensions to three dimensions and back to two dimensions. This has been another Oh Wow Moment from the Children's Museum of Houston. We hope your mind can come out to play. <laughs>